there. Subscribe to my channel. And also press this bell icon. Head to Toe Assessment Pediatrics. Asterisk, hey everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the world of pediatric head-to-toe assessments, and I'm here to help you master this essential skill in no time. Whether you're a seasoned healthcare professional or just starting out, this video is packed with valuable tips and tricks to help you streamline your assessments and achieve more in less time. Problem. I know what you're thinking. Pediatric head-to-toe assessments can be time-consuming and overwhelming. And you're right. But what if I told you there was a way to make them more efficient and enjoyable? With the right approach and a few simple techniques, you can breeze through these assessments like a pro, leaving you with more time to focus on what matters most, providing the best possible care for your little patients. Solution So, buckle up, folks, because we're about to embark on a journey of pediatric assessment mastery. Along the way, we'll uncover the secrets to Asterisk conquering the common challenges of pediatric assessments. Asterisk mastering the art of observation and palpation. Asterisk identifying key developmental milestones. Asterisk documenting your findings like a pro. And by the end of this video, you'll be well on your way to becoming a pediatric assessment ninja, capable of tackling even the most complex cases with confidence and ease. Transition music. Tip 1. Preparation is key. Before you even approach your patient, take a moment to gather all the information you can. Review their medical history, recent complaints, and any relevant lab results. This will give you a head start and help you focus your assessment accordingly. Tip 2. Start with the basics. Begin by assessing your patient's vital signs, including their heart rate, respiratory rate, temperature, and blood pressure. These baseline measurements can provide valuable clues about their overall health status. Tip 3. Observe and palpate with care asterisk asterisk. Use your eyes and hands to carefully inspect your patient's body, paying attention to their skin, hair, nails, and any visible lesions. Palpate their lymph nodes, abdomen, and extremities to detect any abnormalities. Tip 4. Don't forget developmental milestones. Keep in mind your patient's age and developmental stage. Assess their gross motor skills, fine motor skills, language development, and social-emotional skills. Tip 5. Document thoroughly. Record your findings in a clear and concise manner, using appropriate medical terminology. This documentation will be crucial for future care and communication with other healthcare providers. Conclusion. So, there you have it, folks, the key ingredients for pediatric assessment mastery. Remember, practice makes perfect, so don't be afraid to get your hands dirty and learn from your experiences. And if you have any questions along the way, don't hesitate to reach out in the comments below. Asterisk asterisk. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you next time for another dose of healthcare wisdom. Until then, Stay tuned, stay curious, and stay on top of your game.